Don't, don't receive in our newspaper. I wouldn't wear that in public. <laughs> I'd be embarrassed. I wouldn't wear it in public just because... Actually, you know what's funny? You see that small one right there, the 1996 one? Oh. Yeah, that was the Lightnings. That one kind of looks sick. That one kind of does go hard. <laughs> Even the blues. Like, do you see that one right there, Rain? The blues one? Down, down one more? The music right note, there? Yeah. Yeah. That one does go pretty hard. That one goes kind of hard too, yeah. Oh, do they all get their like last names on it? Yeah, they have their last. So it's wow. like, look, here, look at this one. If you look, it would be like, their names would be here. This is just a replica one, but then the other. <laughs> 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 and the other <laughs> side, but the other side is like the year they want. And, and on wow. the inside is the, usually their name and the position they played on the inside. But that's just. Wow. So crazy, man. This is just. <laughs> Dude, so what I was going to say about this, okay, even this one here. So I got a bunch of like little ones. Yeah. So uh, I think back in the day, because uh, my, my uncle used to collect them mm. and you would get them from beer cases. He would get them from beer <laughs> cases and bro, you could like, I have a bunch of them. I kind of want to bring them in now and just like leave those leave ones those here. around. But uh, no, that's like, but uh, why can't I think of the guy that owned the Patriots? Uh, he met, my point is what I was trying to get to with the story is he met Putin. Okay. And he had... Uh, one of the the his championship rings, right? And Putin goes, uh, t- like he goes, he takes it from him. He goes, you could kill somebody with this fucking thing, and puts it in his pocket. And oh, Robert Kraft, that's his name. And Robert just Kraft. never give it back. And never give it back. He never asked for it back or anything. Because I like, wouldn't have asked for it back. No. So he did, <laughs> so like Putin just has Robert Kraft's one of his rings. Do you think he meant to, or like he went home and was like shit? I no. I think like he was just rich enough where he was like, I'm not gonna. You know, I'm not gonna fuck with a judo mask. Like, you know what I mean? Like, because <laughs> like, like he does train. Like Putin does. He train. does. You yeah. ever see the video of him uh, skating around the ice and no one's touching him? Yes. You, yeah. You know what I'm talking. Ever about? seen the videos of him like going to shake people's hands and then like they, they, don't, they don't notice. They don't notice he's going to shake yeah, their hand. And he's just like, it's like, half those people are dead. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> or like the video of like where they thought the one guy was poisoning him. Where the where he went to shake like he was trying to give him a piece of gum. He's like, "You want a piece of gum?" And he's like, "No." He goes, "No." You never seen that? No, I don't think so. Can you f- try and see if you can find that? Putin uh, refuses gum. Just search that up. You ever seen it, the bird salute him? The bird salute him? No. <laughs> it's, fucking, it's probably edited, but it's a fucking hilarious. Like Putin salutes a like a pigeon on the ground, and it looks like the bird's wing goes I up. I don't know if this is gonna be it, but. There's been a couple of there's been a couple attempts. assassinations attempts on his life. Oh, this may be a totally separate thing. But what the fuck happened here? Oh. Oh, was this a plot? I don't think so. No, this is different. But Someone what, put a mine in the road, hoping his fucking motorcade went over it? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, per- yeah, yeah, I think this is going to be it. Yeah, this is it right here. Someone was saying that this was an attempt, but I don't know. I can't. I'm not going to say oh, this is factual. Guys passing out gum. Passing out gum. <laughs> yeah, I'll take one. I'll take one. He don't fuck around with that shit because he's had uh, too many attempts on his life, life dog. Yeah. He's had too many attempts. There was also another assassination attempt that I heard about of uh, where someone was trying to run into his car. Ah. And it wa- he wasn't even never in the car. Like, he was never actually in that car. Shit. So, obviously, that guy. Yeah, fucking that's off, a dead man. That's a dead man. But it's like, when you're him... Mm. Because, like, what's the argument that he's, like, one of the richest people or is the richest guy probably on the planet? One of, at least. Probably one of, yeah. Because, like, what do you want to say? Fucking. A couple trill. A couple trill. Yeah. And he has, like, he, I think he has, like, his own castle and shit. A couple. A couple castles. <laughs> and it's like, bro, that guy, <laughs> that guy is so fucking bad. Let's see what it actually gives us. Because. Oh, is 70 network? billion? Yeah. You know, that's, that's on paper. You know, yeah, that's on paper. paper. On paper, on paper, <laughs> he's probably, he uh, like Month, everything. Uh, monthly income, two billion dollars. Yearly, twenty billion. 
That guy makes so much. <laughs> Dude, that guy's been running the uh, show since 1999. And then, then not he, gonna give it up. He ain't <laughs> giving up shit. Uh, he's, Bro, that mother. People run against him, and he poisons them. Yeah. With uranium. <laughs> Have you ever heard about this? Where he poisons people. Yeah. Yeah. Poison political. So there was a guy who was running against him. Had an attempt on his life, so he fled Russia. I forget where he was, Norway or some shit. Yeah. They put fucking plutonium in his drink, and he nearly died within a day. Then, so he went to the hospital, and then got extradited back to Russia, and is now just sitting in Russian jail. And I think the guy, one of those guys, guards, <laughs> right? Then he killed one of the guards too. Yeah, of that guy. Yeah. Like he ended up killing his fucking guard, dog. Yeah, just, just because like, of how radioactive the shit was. Yeah, he's a pretty cool guy. There's uh, a lot of ways yeah. for him to have tried to kill that dude because what's the most radioactive thing we have? Put it in his drink. Which is fucking crazy. But it's like, bro, that guy don't fuck around. And like no one fucks around with him. They're no. like, we're going to watch. Like we're just going to take our time here. The thing is like even his starkest supporters, like if they question him a little bit, they're ba- they're gone. Yeah. They're gone. I, can't, I forget what was happening. It was a. Uh, do you think it's the jujitsu? No, <laughs> that's propaganda, Jake. I guarantee. you. What do you mean? You don't think he's a black belt in jujitsu? He probably hasn't you trained he, in years. You don't think he's earned that belt? I don't think. I don't think he did. He's a KGB. I don't think you he did. did. I don't think you did. You think in the, you think in the KGB they don't fucking <laughs> they don't teach you how to fucking tap? Somebody, I'm sure they did. Get you in an arm bar, Jake. That was <laughs> nearly fifty years ago. Yeah, but still, he it has been fifty years. I think. Mm-hmm. He ain't doing that shit no more. <laughs> okay. He ain't. He's old. Yeah, he's probably not. How old is he? He's like fucking he, 70. He's got to be in his 70s. He's fucking looking pretty good for 70. Though. Actually, yeah. It's not, ter- it's not terrible. He's 70 dead on. 70 dead on. Fuck. Fucking. He's been running the show since he was 50. All that jujitsu keeps you oh young. My fucking God. <laughs> You think he still rides around on a horse shirtless? I would. Uh, at 70? Fuck yeah. 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 Oh, man. Assumed office? 2012. Sure. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> His mother and father. Fuck. Not looking great. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Killed his brothers. Wow. <laughs> in, wow. In his infancy, killed his two brothers. It's crazy. Damn, dog. That's crazy. Started at school number 193. Especially like him, for him like to be so far up. It's yeah. just like, it's such a power thing. It's like, you know, you can never lose that. No, because he'd lose it and get murdered. Yeah. Cool, because like, it seems like for those guys, it's either like that's the only way out. Mm-hmm. It's essentially it's just like you get either killed. get... You get, it's like really anything. Like if you think of like the mob and shit too, because mm-hmm. I, I, that's what the documentary was called, called Fear City. It's talked about all the like families that were involved with the mobs, like five major families. Yeah. And it literally tells you like the head one. And every single time, if you ever look at any any story, it's either like they go to jail for a long time or, or they, they get, get killed. murdered. Or yeah. they get killed. It's like one of those. It's like that's how it ends for you, though. Right? Do you think they know that? Like, I'm saying from like mob, mob. Oh, the, no, the mob, not Putin? The mob, yes. Yeah. You're either like, going to you, prison or you're dying. You don't get but to do retire. You, do you think, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. do you think they know that going in? Yes. Or do you think it's like so far, they get so far into it, like they just get blinded by it, like, oh, I won't get touched? I'm a, I feel like almost any stage of the mob, if you join the mob, you kind of know you're either going to prison or dying for it. Right. I don't think you've gone like, once I get out of this shit, <laughs> my retirement plan is. <laughs> you hear about, like that one guy that just got caught recently from the mob. Remember? Uh, fuck. God damn it. I'm going to forget his name. We searched, we searched him up the other, like not that long ago. I remember it was in the studio, but I, we, we searched it up and he was on the run for years. Like he didn't get caught till he was like fucking 70 something years old. That does happen sometimes. Yeah. And it's the- like at that point, like. They got away. Just let him. <laughs> well, like, Just do you think, but like, because he was in rough shape when we searched that guy up. Like, he was in a fucking, like, they were like, he's in a wheelchair. And they're like, okay, like, dude, you didn't really, 
You didn't catch him. Yeah, you know what I mean? He was kind of just sitting in his house. Like, I think it was, I thought it was essentially like a nurse that kind of routed him out because he was going to get medication. Like, I thought it was him going to a clinic to get something. And the nurse is like, I think this motherfucker is him. Isn't that a crime boss? (laughs) Yeah. Isn't that, isn't that one of the biggest crime boss in Sicily? Like, isn't that him? And is uh, he allowed? Because he allowed to be here. (laughs) Because that's what he was. He wasn't like a state's mob boss. He was like from Italy, like. They, the and, they, and they didn't like they use guns don't get me wrong but their thing was like we're gonna bomb your car while you're inside it yeah so like that was like their whole that's how they killed everybody they even talked about stories about him like how we just bring people out to a, like a field and just be him and the and you just hear him shoot somebody and he'd walk back he's like just taking him out for a walk <laughs> taking him out for the walk <laughs> taking him out for a walk and then they just go eat dinner that's why you always see those mob movies where like we gotta go yeah, fast they, like, dinner in, bro and good fellas when they uh buried the motherfucker they went to a diner right after went to a diner <laughs> they went to a diner right after like fuck that made, fucking that time all already. that <laughs> all that digging maybe uh, it's funny because i heard a joke from nate baragatz he's a comedian mm-hmm. and he talked about he goes you got to think about this like killing somebody they're like it gets so exhausting that they are like i think that's good enough like you know what I'm digging a hole like it's like the thing that would, I'm obviously paraphrasing the yes. joke, but he goes, the thing that literally would get you caught and put you to jail for life, people are like, I think that's good enough. Like, you know, I'm they, not digging. It's always a shallow grade. It's never like the right amount. Like they're like six feet, man. Like fucking, you think four is good? Like, <laughs> you ever, you've never had to dig, dig a hole. For I mean, I feet. have, but okay. Not six feet, not six feet. Yeah, that's no. what I mean. Like even, even four feet. Once you get to that four feet, you're like, this shit's hard because <laughs> it's like clay at that point. It's fucking like it's every shovel you gotta kick into the ground and then pry it up. You're not, you're not scooping nothing. Yeah. You're prying it and then throwing it, bro. It's like even, uh, you know, I heard a story like uh, the other day where it's like this guy kills his wife or whatever, and then he the way he gets caught is he rents everything. Like he rented a doze, like uh, <laughs> like he he literally rented like. <laughs> A digger. Have you equipment to dig a hole? To oh dig a hole and then God. just bury his wife. Like, that's how he did it. Pre-dig your hole. But it, but he, th- that's how he got caught because it was like, it was like he killed his wife and then the next day, because like obviously he reported her missing. Yes. And it was like, what was he doing the day before? And they looked through his transactions. They're like, why'd you rent a dope? Like a fucking big ass like uh, <laughs> Why'd you rent the excavation equipment? Yeah. What was that, what was that what about? What was that about? What were you excavating? And then they fucking just, of course they see the fresh grass. They dig it up and they're like, there's a body. You're just where your wife's at. Hey, uh, why is your wife uh, buried in your backyard? Yeah. Yeah. And you that's think like, we wouldn't notice that? <laughs> it's like even the, the other, I think I said it before on here. Where it's like the guy who he cert he the way they caught him was they looked through his Google searches yeah and it oh was like fucking God. how to get rid of a body at like three a.m. and I like and they gave you the timestamps yes. and, and then I think when they were reading that one time it went off like in a different direction like he searched something else completely up and then it went right back to like okay now how long is the body how much like, does a trip to Italy cost yeah <laughs> <laughs> but it's like all those and it's like I don't know. I don't know. It's like, it's crazy because it's like that. His face while they're reading that was fucking terrifying. Yeah, where he was just standing he was there, just standing there motionless. Because it's like those people just face. know that they're caught. Like yeah. it's like even uh, like where, where you're just like you, I think it's like for those guys. Obviously, I don't know, but it's yeah. like for you, when you just sit there and like you know, it's like even like when you looked at Jeffrey Dahmer and he's like the reading this thing, he's not even looking at anybody. He's just like, yeah, yeah. it's like it's kind of it's kind of the end of the road. That's Do why you I'm ever, here. <sighs> Do you remember that guy, uh, Chris Watts? Isn't that the guy that killed his wife and kids? Yeah. Yeah. And then, like, went back to the house and called the cops. And Well, no. The cops went to the house, mm-hmm. got in, and then he showed up and was like, I don't know where they went. Yeah. And the, the neighbor anywhere. was like, that's fucking weird. That's remember the neighbor? Was yeah, the like, neighbor had the, his security camera. He goes, hey, come over here, man. I want to... Sh- Mr. Officer, come over here. I want to show you yeah, something. Yeah, because he showed him like yeah. that he was dragging out shit. Yeah, he goes, hey, it's uh, 5 a.m. Uh, and he's dragging a lot of large objects into his truck yeah and then uh it was like the, like they were in the house like i remember there yeah. was like body cam footage and the neighbors like he's never once acted like this ever like he's <laughs> not really a talkative guy he's really jumpy and shit like that yeah. <coughs> excuse me <coughs> ah, fuck they interrogated that man for i think 14 hours right and it's like and then didn't he just cave in isn't that how after he just, a while yeah, yeah. I thought th- I thought maybe they had enough evidence, but I thought it was like if he didn't cave in, like he would have got away with it. No, you no. think so, like you think it was enough evidence? Like I don't, I, I don't know. So. I never watched the documentary. I kind of want to watch. It I now. haven't. I've never seen a documentary. It's hard. It's it, hard but... for me to watch those, which is crazy because I can watch like 
all this other horrific shit. But when it comes to that stuff, it's like hard for me to watch. Yeah, I will watch it though. Like, like I said, I watched that like the Boston Marathon thing mm-hmm. recently. That was crazy. I watched the first forty minutes of the Boston. Yeah. Did you just recently start it? Yeah, like yeah. the day you talked about it. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's uh, dude, it's it's kind of crazy. You should. Uh, I think it's just more interesting how they caught them, how they caught them, and how like they really put it together because like they went, and especially for. I mean, I think they did a good job for in the sense of how quick it was because it was like within the first like just after forty eight hours, like they okay, they're like we got we know who they are, yeah. and it's like just through like their um, like in the sense of through them just stealing that guy's car. I know you didn't watch it all yet, yeah. but them stealing that guy if that if they never stole that guy's car, the cops never would have gotten these guys. No. I don't think because they because. Uh, they were going to that gas station to fill up and just drive. Mm. And like, who knows what they were going to do with the, the student, obviously. Yeah. The student just took that chance, though. Was which like, is, oh, this is my chance. I got like to book bro, it. You, I, I'm telling you, like, I know you only watch the first 40 minutes. Watch all of it. Mm. I'm telling you, watch all of it. Because it, it, like the way they do it and the special agents, the way... It's interesting to see the FBI and the that, that's got to happen so often where the police... They're like, hey, we got to use the public's health. And the FBI is like, we want to control situations. So, yeah. like, why don't you keep your mouth shut? And then when they found out that somebody did leak the information, because that's how exactly how those photos got uh, oh, it out. Oh, was leaked? It was leaked oh, out. Shit. And they always thought the commissioner had something to do with it. So, they had, like, it was crazy the beef that they had. Because they were talking about, like, almost every meeting, it would be, like, the co- the commissioner would be like, I want this. We should do it this way. And the FBI was like, Pfft. Yeah, we're not doing that. We're not gonna do that. Yeah, we're not gonna do that. <laughs> but it gets it, it just gets wild because they track down that fucking car, mm-hmm. get in a shootout, try to arrest the brother after he's been shot like I don't know how many times and just didn't and go down. And then the other brother runs him over. And then the other brother runs him over. Get first of all, it's you're gonna I think you're gonna watch that. Yeah. And you're gonna fucking sit there and be like, because for the amount of cops that did show up, like the cruisers, he the guy after he ran over his brother. Drove right past all the cruisers and not one, like, there was a lot, dude. It and wasn't not like... Not one of them chased him down. Right. And you know what the most fucked up thing was? Why is that? Is when they tracked the car down and seen that it was in the next town over, they told the cops there that it was just a, a carjacking and they may be armed. They never, they never they fucking told... They never told the cops that, hey, these are the guys that did the fucking bombings in Boston. Yeah. Like, they never once said that to them. Was it the FBI that was no, doing that? And, and not to mention that they killed a cop before that. Mm-hmm. Like, well, they never once mentioned a thing. Was it the FBI that was controlling that information? Because they do uh, that. They do they, that a lot. I think it was, like, when they were dispatched. Like, it was just dispatch. Like, letting uh, cops know near the area that, hey, there was a carjacking. Mm. And that it, I don't think it was actually, like... Because they probably weren't given all the information. They pr- probably... In which... They had no idea. So as the cops are getting the shootout, with these guys, they're throwing like I don't. It's not Molotovs. I forget what it is. It's like it's essentially like flashbangs. I would mm-hmm. almost call them. They're like mini bombs. It's like they start, and then they did the pressure cooker bomb, where, yeah. which they use at Boston, and they actually try to throw out the cops. And what ended up happening was that pressure cooker bomb. One of the things weren't sealed properly, so that it didn't build up enough pressure. So it kind of just so spewed it kind of, out. It kind of just spewed out, and it didn't. It didn't end up like he said it was loud, but he goes it wasn't like he a was a, a bomb. But it was fucking insane. It was insane because then the guy just, he drove a block. Literally he drove a block away from all those cruisers and got out and hid in, hid in that boat. Well, cops aren't great everywhere. Not everywhere, but yeah. it was just interesting. It's interesting to see because like when you watch shit unfold like that of like, because we always talk about agencies holding things. Yeah. Like, you know, we talk about that book chaos all the time. Do you read that book yet? I haven't read it. Though. Oh, damn. I know enough, <laughs> but like, well, you know about enough because yeah. we always talk about it, Yeah. but it's like, it's always shit like that where it's like all these agency holds up and they're like, we're not, <laughs> we would we're never just taking control of situations. We're just we're talking. We're definitely not wa- covering our own ass. What are you talking about? <laughs> You're insane. Yeah. Idiots. Idiots will throw you in jail. Oh, you mean that valuable information that could be used? <laughs> you, you don't need it. Figure it out. You I don't. These local fucking cops need that shit. They, they just don't. need to arrest the guy. <laughs> Doesn't it didn't matter if they that they were bombers. They didn't, they didn't need to know all that shit. But yeah, then uh, yeah, they just caught him through like literally surveillance footage. Off, actually, the way they caught the one dude is just through a bar, uh, the bar video, like the bar pointing down at him, and then a woman across the street wow. with her phone. Because she was videotaped or took a picture. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, because they, they were getting like a thousand photos a minute 
after they they were getting photos that weren't actually real. Yeah, like from Reddit, which was like fucking their investigation up completely. They were like, br- like we we run it through the guy who analyzes them. He'd be like, "This has been f- through this Photoshop." Yeah, yeah, like that bag isn't even real because they would just Photoshop a bag into it, which is fucking also weird. But yeah, people are the worst, and people do their own investigation, which is good. like, <laughs> I don't know. Do you ever see that shit where like, pe- well, obviously you're on Reddit, yeah. but like where people do their own investigation where like, I got a conclusion and you're like, let's just hear this guy oh, out. Hear man. him out. He might have something. I think me and you are the only guys that would go on that shit and be like, well, let's just fucking hear him out. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like what does he got to say? Like, well, what does he got to go the ahead, thing is, The shit. thing is though, is we wouldn't take it as like real information. We would just be like, well, that was good. That's an interesting, pr- interesting perspective take. on that. And uh, we'll get back to you. We'll look into that. We'll get right back on it <laughs> at you. It's so what fucking. What if it funny. sounds cool? Or like, what if he's like, "Let's close. Let's close, maybe." <laughs> you're, you're like, you're like, I think you know what, man. I agree with that. Let's like, <laughs> yeah, let's let's push this even harder. It's like when you ever when you tell me about like the Mets subreddit. Yeah. Like, because I'm not on that. You should I, check it out. I want to check you it out. Check it out because like explain to people what you see in there because we talk about it but we never like. It's talk- just it's mostly just like people going like, is this real meth or, hey, does it look like I do meth? Yeah. And then it's a picture of a person who, obviously, does do meth. Yeah. Right. And other times it's people looking for love. It's other. It's one of those, right? <laughs> people looking for it's, love. It's P- looking for love. They're it's like, like who's in who's in Boston. <laughs> who's tweaking in Boston tonight dude I uh so that before we started and I was yeah. telling you about the other podcast I was listening to that show the horrific videos yeah. they also do this cool thing where they have people send in like video cause like you know the one of the cool things is when especially when you like people are just allowed to post almost anything to the internet to a degree yeah. uh, was people they're like people looking for love like you would have these people who are like hi I'm in like one of the things okay I'll give you an example one of the things was they have this guy, uh, he's blind, completely blind. And one of the things was, he was like, Hey everyone, I just want to let you know that <laughs> he goes, Hey everyone, I just want to let you know, I'm really into like shitting videos. So if you could please have like, don't, and then he would like the requests he would have were crazy. So he'd just be like, don't, don't talk, don't talk in the background. Uh, just, you know, go to the bathroom undo your. I want to hear your belt being undone mm-hmm. and I want your pants undone and I want to hear you on the toilet. I don't want no noise, no mouth noise though. None. And it was like specific request. And he would just post it to like whoever. And he'd be like, this is where you can contact me. Full info. Like, I mean, full, full legal info- name, full legal name, everything. And you're like, those people do not care. Like, yeah, you want to talk about, you know how like, you you know, people get self-conscious about certain things. Those guys d- put everything out there. Like, that's a brave thing to put. Like, I like shitting videos. I'd like to get some, uh, I'd like some to get scat some, play vids out of you. Yeah. And it was just like, no please, kink shaming. Like, no that's kink. Thing, no, of course. no, 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 no. I wasn't. Hey, and he was straight to the point. We end up <laughs> like, he was, he, he, he didn't build up to that. And the thing is, after he said that, he was like saying, "Here's also hobbies I also like. I'm a teacher. Like, guy, <laughs> this guy, this guy was like, teacher. here's my other stuff that here's I do. Here's my other stuff that I'm also into. And it was just like, it's great. Like one of the like another guy was like, uh, he was clearly on more than just drinking. Mm-hmm. Like, uh, and he goes, I want to play with your ass and yeah. And then like he's like, if you want me to play with your ass, here's where you can find me. Yeah. And then he was like, it's all I hate nobody. I like women and men's like whatever you want. Whatever you into, I'm probably into. I'm weird as shit. I like getting pissed on. And you're like, you're yeah. fucking, you're listening to these people and you're like, that's good, man. I hope they find like, somebody. Like, you ever think like. I hope they find somebody. Dude, you know? dude, I wish nothing but the best for those people. Yeah. Like, I, I, I look at my, I'm like, bro, t- t- you talk about happiness. Like, those those guys are. Those are, the, those are the guys that will get it. They'll get it. They'll, like, especially if you have no shame. Like, they're, we talk about shoot from the. Shoot from the hip, baby. shoot from the hip. Shoot they don't from the fuck hip. around. It's like you gotta have so much. Con- That's a different type of confidence. Like there's, you know, like you could be like an attractive guy, yeah, and you're like that like confident, us. right? Yeah. Well, <laughs> right, you know, you get it, yeah, yeah. yeah you get it. Yeah. And then, and then, and then you got that dude where he's, <laughs> like, okay sorry it's like it's like the the it's guy that's jump. like the, that's a te- that's a ten and then yeah. you have the guy who's like. I'll eat you at. Like, what are we talking? What are we talking about? What, what are, are you we- doing this afternoon, sweetheart? Like I got no shame. Like you know what yeah. I mean. I, s- it- I remember this one post <laughs> on the mess subreddit. 
And the guy's like, I need to get away from my wife for a bit. Uh, looking for a, a female companion yeah. to smoke with. Yeah. Like, just say you're trying to cheat on your wife tonight, bro. It's all right. We're all friends here. A lot of them are fun. Like, especially because like, they, they even show, like, couple ones where they're, like, it's, we're, like they introduce themselves. Yeah. Like, they're like, this is, you know, I'm fucking... Bob and you know Miller, Bob and, Joanne. Bob and Joanne, and we're you know we're looking for people that are also in to you know having three sums and maybe even four sums or into an open relationship, and you're just like, and you, I hope Bob's doing. I well. ho- I'm like I <laughs> like I hope they're Good doing for great. Bob. And it's funny because they'll be like, and listen, you just got to understand the rules. Like you got to leave after. Like there's no sticking around. What's the point? And you're like, okay, can. Yes, <laughs> like uh, I guess if you're not gonna have fun, uh, you're gonna be weird about it. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna be weird about the. Threesome. You're gonna be such a weird about about this threesome. Why don't you get out of here? Fuck! I remember this fucking meme, and it, it was like me and a threesome. The guys, it's just like a guy going, "Are you guys mad at me?" <laughs> He's like getting self conscious in the threesome. <laughs> Dude, I heard this guy and he's talking about how he's like, he's like, oh, so, you know, we're doing like our second or third threesome. And he goes, the, the other girl's like smoking hot. He's talking about his wife and this other girl. Yeah. And he's like, yeah, this girl's smoking hot, blah, 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 whatever. And he goes, I don't know what came over me. He goes, they look like they were just having the time of their life. And he goes, I was just sitting in the corner and I looked at my dick in the eye and said, please, <laughs> please don't do this right now. <laughs> yeah. He goes, come on. Get, get, come, <laughs> come on, man. Come on, man. Because <laughs> it's so funny. It's so funny. Shit. You think it's a lot of pressure? No, it's not. It's, it's not as much as you think. Oh, yeah? You've been in <laughs> <laughs> You're like, yeah, fucking, <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm not going to tell that. My mom listens to this. Hey, mom. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want your mom knowing about like all the. No, no. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> it all the three. Said already is more than enough. Yeah, yeah, I just, oh, she's going to ask me about that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just be like, not any of the gay orgy stuff though, right? Oh, no, I'd tell her about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's funny. I was talking to this guy about furry orgies today. Mm. Uh, he brought it up. He goes. My friend, uh, he lives out of town, uh-huh. and he's uh, he's worried that the orgies he's going to are getting weird. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, how so? What do you mean? He goes, people keep wearing animal masks. So he's like, I don't even know who I'm fucking anymore. Oh, wow. Like, oh, that's got to be tough. <laughs> did, you have, did you break the news to him that he was in a fort? Did he know he was? Uh, I mean, like, it wasn't my friend going to the orgies. Oh, oh. Okay. It was a friend of his. That was going to the orgies. Getting concerned that the... Orgies were getting too weird. Yeah, it was yeah, getting too weird, right? <laughs> well, he goes, I don't even know who I'm fucking anymore. <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's got to be tough. Like, you want to avoid certain people at the orgy. All right. We haven't talked about orgies in a long time. We haven't talked about orgies. It's interesting you're bringing it up. Uh, because <laughs> because, <laughs> because I, like, there was this, uh, I was listening to Two Bears, One Cave, and they had that, uh, they had a porn star on. Why is everyone just having porn stars on? Dude, it's like the thing. We should get some local porn stars on. So well, like it's amateur of, only fans. Yeah, yeah. I know a few now. Yeah, yeah. We'll get them on uh, for sure. <laughs> yeah. Ask them about their work. But like the interesting is like their day jobs or the both. <laughs> okay. And uh, yeah, we'll do both. And she was talking. So she's talking about how she lines people up for her orgies. Oh, and okay. it was like, OK, so it's like she she's like, I allow fans. I allow fans to get involved. And she's like, she's like, but you have to have a test, uh, a, a test the day before. It has to come up clean, it's like a memory test. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> See if you're a true fan or not. That's yeah, t- <laughs> yeah, that would have been like, yeah. What's my best video? Yeah, you know what I mean. But no. So she, she's like talking about all this stuff, and she's like, it's so interesting because she goes, all the guys are weird. <laughs> she goes. She goes, all the guys are weird because they're not, like, they won't go first. Like, yeah. she'll be, like, you kind of have to tell them, like, let's go, guys. Like, let's get going here. Because, like, she's she's so open to it, right? This yeah. girl is, like, this, she does it for a fucking living. Like, she's getting pent up in so many fucking positions. Like, she don't have no, like, she's she about it. Like, she's yeah. down to the, like, come on, guys. Like, this is for you. Like, you know what I mean? Like, this is for the fans. I got all these pretty girls here, and you're not even fucking, you're everyone's not even trying. Shy, which is, like, oh, No one wants to be the first guy to go into the orgy. Yeah, like what do you do? You think you want to be? Listen, I'm third guy. No, 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 not even, <laughs> not even that. Here, listen, you get you get invited to an orgy, right? Yeah, you get invited yeah. to an orgy. It happens. Do you do you want to be 
early to the orgy or late? Early. Early? Earlier. Earlier. Yeah, How early? Wanna... How early? Well, let's, like I said, you don't want to be the first guy. You don't want to be the first guy. Even the guy. second one's kind of iffy. Third guy, everyone's kind of already warmed up. Right. But if you're showing up late, there's way too much attention on you. Yeah. Because like... Hey, what the fuck We've are you? all been waiting for you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> That's a- <laughs> I don't know. Oh, like, yeah, shit. the third guy. So, like, still early then. Orgy's at 7. You got What are you getting at? 6.30? 6.45? I'm saying, I'm saying 15 minutes early. 15 and minutes. And then I wait outside to count do how many stre- people are going. Do you going. stretch to warm up? I feel like it's stretched before I showed up. Yeah. <laughs> you pop in a Viagra before you hop in that bitch? No. No, you getting in there? I just... In and out. In and out. <laughs> like, you don't want to hang around yeah, too yeah. long. It gets weird near the end. Everyone's well, tired. Well, you stay for the buffet. Well, <laughs> that's why you show up. Yeah. <laughs> you, you eating before? Like you get there and you're like, well, hold on. Everyone has I a meal. Know, I, didn't, I didn't know that we were had all this great food here. <laughs> Are these pastries? This who brought these? <laughs> <laughs> and then like the girls like they're homemade, and you're like, oh, okay, oh, that's cool. You brought them from home for yeah. everybody. What's in it? Listen, <laughs> you're you're ten years into your marriage. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Your wife asks you about spicing things up, and she goes, we should go to a swingers resort. Oh, fuck. How do you make it seem like you're not that into it when you definitely are? <laughs> I, I'm into this? You know you are. Okay. You hate her already. It's 10 years. Okay. You hate okay. her. And I have to convince her? That is like, oh, this, is, this was totally your idea. This was her idea or my idea? You have to convince her that it is her idea. It's her idea. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I don't, I, that's a good that's honestly a good one dude is this the shit you guys talk about on the site no no this is what I think about when, I, when I'm like oh I gotta talk to Jake today for at yeah. least an hour yeah. uh, okay. it's like the baby mama question at the gas station remember that where like if you have to defend your either baby yeah, mama yeah did I bring it up with the podcast yeah I you did. did I think didn't we say that was off mic that was off mic all right. Okay. Uh, just in case I didn't. Do you want me to? Should, you we, want, do, should we do finish this? yours? Finish yours, then I'll ask. Okay. A I have to convince her. It's already. Like, yeah. I'd be like, babe, listen, let's go. Like, you, like she goes, I want to spice things up, and you're like, we should go to a swingers resort, but you have to make it seem like it's her idea, so she doesn't hate you for bringing it up. <sighs> That's hard. That's all. And hard. I will write down your answer because I'm gonna need it this weekend. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Five hundred words. <laughs> Five hundred words or less. Don't use big ones. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> dude, I don't know. That's a fucking good. Cause like, how are you gonna convince her that it's her idea? Like, you gotta be like, listen, we need to go. We need a vacation. That's a, and you and you're like, hey. oh, and you like, you're going through the prices and you're showing right. her pictures no, and no, you no. go, oh my god, this is a swingers resort. Oh. And you, <laughs> no, no, but you, you first you say Miami because that's where all the swinger resorts are pretty much mostly. Are. Yes. The, the, the capital of swinger resorts is Miami. Yes. So you go, listen, <laughs> you now. You you say like listen like why don't we change it? You actually just this is what you would do. Yeah. You just buck in a swingers resort and not know like be not like whoa well, like whoa what where are we at? And then you end up meeting a couple. Listen, you end up meeting a couple. You guys start having a few drinks. Yeah. Maybe you have a fucking you know maybe you're on edibles or something like you know like people are like you know real loose get real loose, loose loose and then like. The thing is, I think you let the swingers do the talking. You have to. They're the convincing ones. You have you don't, to. Listen, you just got to get her to the location. <laughs> the, swing, the swingers will do everything else. They I feel will, like you have to sign some forms or something. What do you mean? When you're going, you're not just showing up. No, no, no. You show up. Listen, you show up because you're booked there because they make you sign the forms there. Yeah. So like, you're, are you just hoping to God well, she doesn't read these no, forms? No, no, like, no, no, no. You hope. You just, babe, like it was cheap. Like, let's just stay. <laughs> like we don't have to do anything. I know there's nothing else to do around here. Yeah, in Miami. Just, yeah, yeah. Well, it's not in the center of Miami. It's yeah. outside it's out, town, outskirts of Miami. You're just in Florida, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then you—that's all you say, though. That's all you say. say. Prices were cheap. You just say yeah, the prices are cheap. Like let's not make a big deal about it. We don't have to go. Like we won't even go. Out. And then you will. Then you we will won't even talk to the swingers. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then obviously a cool couple comes along and then she's like, I really like them. And then yeah, that's when you're like, okay. And the night continues. Maybe not the first night, but the second night. Second like night. if you're there for a week, what do you think? By at least a th- second or third night she's in. Oh, not, I was going to say hour. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. She's like, yeah, you're right. We're here. Oh, yeah. wow, we're already here. <laughs> Might as well have a good time. <laughs> yeah. That's uh, yeah. I don't know. And then, uh, the other thing, if I were to defend my baby, mo- like, let if, me ask the question. Yeah, ask the in question. case I don't know. 
you're at a gas station with your side piece. Your baby mama shows up and shoots your side piece. She lives. Whose back do you have in court? If your baby mama goes to jail, you got to take care of that kid. I'm but it's also like your side piece, you know? Like, you yeah. don't want to piss her off. <laughs> you are. I, that, at that point, I think there's a little, you're a little more past than getting pissed off. But uh, <laughs> it, it ain't your fault, your baby mama crazy. <laughs> What is the, how is that your fault? It's not. It's exactly. Not. Who's back do you have in court? Oh, my God. Uh, okay. I'm going to have my baby. She's, like, she's the mother of my kid. Yeah, you know, right? Yeah. yeah, I don't want to take care of it. Yeah, yeah. And, you can have another uh, side piece, but you can't choose another mother of your baby. Right, you're right. Right. You're right. right. I know my side piece ain't going to do as good of a job. Yeah. Right. And, like, you know, she's going to need time to recover. She's got a bullet hole in her. She's got a bullet hole in her. <laughs> she ain't going to love that kid. Yeah. And yeah, she's, we both and she's gonna and she's it. either rubbing your face all the time, like yeah, your baby mama, <laughs> your, your baby mama shot me. You're when like, your baby mama shot me, remember your baby mama? You're like, are you gonna drop this? Like, fuck. Can you? It's been a week. Yeah, let, let it, it go. go. Like she shot you one time. Like Buddy, it's a nine millimeter. You're fine. Look, it was just the leg. <laughs> like, look at that. So yeah, you, you defend the baby mama. Yeah, I'm court. defending the baby mama. Yeah, I feel like if I do, like my child support should go down. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if I do my best to keep her out of jail after she shot my side I paid piece. your lawyer fees. Fucking <laughs> relax. Bring my fucking child support down. <laughs> I know I'm only giving you 50 bucks, but fuck. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> fucking. These are good. Like, these are the questions that should be asked and answered. Well, that's why I'm asking them on a public forum. Yeah. Right. Any, anyone can leave comments. <laughs> <laughs> anyone give your opinions what you would do. <laughs> like, I, In either of those situations, completely hypothetical, I promise. All hypothetical situations. <laughs> all, all of them are hypothetical This situations. month has been awful. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't even... I, I don't know, man. Like, yeah. that shit's wild. <laughs> like, Say you're at a party. Oh, okay. You think it's just a normal little shindig mm -hmm. with some weird art kids. Mm. You go to walk by an open door and you just happen to notice that the room you've thrown your coat in, there's two furries with full mass and tails basically fucking each other. On my on my uh, jacket? Right beside your coat. Oh, Do you... Is it my good coat? You know what coat it I'm was, talking about? It was my leather coat. And I'm like, I really like that one. You know? So you I help? don't want... <laughs> Did you get in there? No, I was like... This is their one time to be themselves, you know? And also, like, they're going to, like, meow at me or something. So I had to I had to just leave it. <laughs> That's a hard one, eh? Yeah, well, it's like no you check back in a bit to see if you can get it. Knowing your jacket was in there. Well, let's just wash it. But it's like... <laughs> <laughs> now, I couldn't really wear it the same after. I did have to get rid of it. Right. Furry sacks on my coat? <laughs> Did you actually get rid of it? Yeah, I did. Oh fuck! Yeah, that was, this was like uh, six, six, seven years ago now. Oh my god! Yeah, it's been a while, but it's I still have it burned in my mind. Yeah, it's something that's not gonna leave. That's for sure. Yeah, it was the tails. It was the tails. They weren't wearing pants, so ah. <laughs> what a fun crowd! Yeah, what a fun crowd! But yeah, dude, I don't know. Like, uh, if I was me, like, it's my good jacket. I gotta get in You're there. You're getting in there. You're I'm, stopping them. I. <laughs> It's my Stop jacket. the yip fest. It's my it's my fucking jacket, dude. It's the good one I got too. You know, if it was one? that blue one. Oh, yeah. I'd stop him. Yeah, if it was that blue one. I'm in there. Yeah, <laughs> that's Jake's jacket. Whoa! <laughs> Stop fucking for a second. I gotta grab this coat. <laughs> it's not even yours. <laughs> you ever like like sometimes I, I'll take my jacket and then you see other people's jacket. Like, you know, the coat room, like someone would be like, let me grab your jacket. Yeah. And then you're like, Oh, where'd my jacket go? And they're like, it's in this, it's always in a spare room. Just a sp it's, on a always, bed. it's on a bear. And then you're looking at all these other jackets and you're just like, wow, that's actually a nice fucking jacket. Whoever brought so that. So you grab theirs. So you grab theirs and, and yours over top. Right. And then leave. And you're yeah. like, and I'm out of here. Goodbye, everyone. It's like the, one of the trench coats, and I have a jacket over top. You wear like three different jackets. <laughs> and I'm like, I brought all these from home. <laughs> you know, like it was, oh, shit. Like That's you definitely didn't feel an that, episode of Seinfeld. Yeah. You didn't it. feel that wind outside? You didn't wear. Surely. You didn't think of wearing three jackets? <laughs> Should have thought of that. Fucking idiot. It's fucking October. <laughs> <laughs> it's the middle of June. <laughs> it's the middle of June. You didn't. You had that fucking. Oh, I have only jackets at like certain like times of the season. 
I think. I try and wear jackets all year. <laughs> I do too. Different I like layers em. of jackets. I'm a jacket guy. When it got warm, at, like when it was warm last week, I was just like, what the fuck? Now I'm like, Jake, I, could, I was dying. Yeah, it was. was no, dying. it was hot. Look at my tan lines. Mm-hmm. Look at these. Look at my look at my face. Mm-hmm. This is gross looking. It looks good. I look like <laughs> I, this part of my skull did not see the sun. <laughs> it's that hard hat, dog. It's the, it's the glasses and hard hat. I, I feel stupid. I saw myself in the mirror. I'm like, I look stupid. <laughs> it's not much. It's just like it comes with the, you know, working construction. The yeah. comes with the, you know what I mean? It's like, listen, you're going to get those. It was either that or you lose all your teeth and you can't lose your teeth because your mom's a fucking. Why would I lose my teeth? Usually that's how construction workers go. I don't go. think. No. <laughs> you don't think so? Usually the hard hat ain't protecting the teeth. I wasn't saying that, but. <laughs> <laughs> I was just saying through the years of like smoking and everything. Well, yeah, but I'm not going to lose my teeth. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm saying you're not. You're saying I'd either get shitty tan lines or lose my teeth. It's one That's of the two. That's the thing you just said. Yeah. No. Yeah, it is. It's you can live two. without either of those things. You can live without either of those? Of you can. Getting the tan line or that? Yeah, I didn't have tan lines like this last year. And why do you have them this year? Because I actually wear my protective equipment this year. Ah, there it is. That's what I was waiting for. That's what I was waiting for. Yeah. There it is. My my glove tan lines are the worst ones. I look like an idiot. <laughs> when I, I worked at my old shop and I was in the sun all the time, I'd have tan lines from like jewelry and shit. Yeah. Actually, oh, when I oh. when I would fucking, uh, when I would be in like even my pool and shit, like one time I had a whole thing outside and I, bro, I was out there for hours and like I got, burnt like i mean burnt yeah and fucking like just like my necklace like tan line was so bad like i mean it was so fucking bad dude <laughs> it's like you could tell like if it moved it you was like it. yeah you could see the like, white lines but some people thought they were tripping like they were like what do you have fucking another big ass chain on and i'm like no, no, no. i'm double that's chained under up. my yeah i'm double chained up <laughs> i'm triple chained up dog damn bro yeah thanks dude damn or like watch tan lines yeah like shit like that yeah, I've sock, never, sock never had that issue. Watch tan lines? Yeah. You don't wear your watch there, right? Not in the sun. <laughs> Why not? I don't want to damage it. That's fair. Just That's a kidding. nice watch that you have. Oh, I'm just kidding. I just, uh, for some reason, I've never had to be like, oh, I got a watch tan line. That's disgusting. I'm just, yeah, I get it. It's okay. just my fucking hands. My hands are pale as shit compared to my arms. It's, uh, well, it's just like, it's like the uh, roofers. Where they become like yeah. permanently fucking like tan, yes. like they're red. All the time. All the time. All the time. I remember I fucking, there used to be a guy that trained at my gym that was like that. Like he was just like literally leather <laughs> and fucking just. Yeah, the skin and the sun really fucks you up, bro. The sun does fuck you up. But then at that point, you're just like, look, man, I rock with the sun. I ain't getting burned. Me and the sun are bros Me like that. Me and the that. sun are fucking chilling like that. We out here. <laughs> <laughs> Me and the sun out here. Me and the sun actually out here fucking balling. Yeet. Yeah. Yeah, no. What's up? Oh man. You know how like uh <laughs> like, what would you just read? <laughs> no. <laughs> you know how Elon Musk started labeling news na- yeah, networks as that. like fucking government funded. Uh, government media. funded. Yeah. Bunch of the bunch of news networks are dropping off Twitter. I'm like, bro, that's I guarantee you that's how most people are getting their news from you now. You're just you're off there now. You're useless for a lot of people. Bro, we searched it up not that long ago that fucking news like ratings and shit. They're fucking th- Minecraft YouTubers are doubling their fucking watch. Bro, bro, <laughs> average like people who are doing like not even that big of podcast. Like I shouldn't even say that. But not Our that podcast is bigger than Fox News. Might as well be. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> like, but that I mean, like people are getting their information from like, and then it's like, I don't know. It's like, because like, he's not wrong. Yeah. Right. So like you can't blame him for that. But then they're just like, uh. it's like when he was talking about the. Uh, free speech shit on Twitter, and the uh, NBC guy or whatever mm-hmm. was trying to challenge him on it, and he was like, "Can you give me an example?" And the guy just would not give him an example. He's like, "I'm just asking for one. <laughs> like, I'm just asking for one Ask example." Ask for one, yeah. And he's just like, "I see it. <laughs> I see it. I see it." And he goes, "I've been off Twitter for." He said he, he said something like, "I was I've been off Twitter for a month now because the last thing I seen." And he goes, can you give the example of, like what you've seen that would make you off? He goes, I forget. And he goes, how do you forget something that, that got you so affected the last month of your life? Yeah, that literally got you so pissed off that you didn't want to use the app anymore. <laughs> and he was just like, it just does. <laughs> it just does. <laughs> it just it pisses me off. Fair but enough. I don't know. Yeah, Fair I don't. Know. But, and like, yeah, that kind of is a weird route, right? But I mean, like, 
what do you think they'll do? They'll probably just all go to their own. I know like the true, obviously the true shit is like right wing stuff or like for Donald Trump when he was on there, right? Was it the true media thing or the app? What was it? True social. True social. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, that, but like you, they'll all do that. Yeah. It, it feels like that's what it will come to, right? Realistically, it's just going to be like, okay. Cause we talked about it before. Everyone's just going to do their own shit privately. Yeah. But like, everyone's just going to be like, it's like people like, you know, okay. The podcast studio, YMH, YMH studios. Like they have, they built a business off it. So they have like your mom's house podcast. Uh, uh, where's my mommy at? That's like his wife's Tom talks. That's Tom's thing. Uh, two bears, one cave. That's theirs. The Danny Brown show, the Dr. Drew show at night. Like, oh. They, they they built a literally a their own production company just just through that. And I think that that's how a lot of them will do it. Because even if like let's say they push it so far where you know what like how Joe went to Spotify. Yeah. Right? Because he was like, I'm getting censored off YouTube all the time and then Spotify came with them and said, We won't censor your stuff, we'll offer you this deal. But you hundred million dollars. Hundred million dollars exclusively uh exclusively on podcast, uh, uh, Spotify. He was like, Okay, yeah. I think they'll just do the same thing. Yeah. Even if they didn't get that same offer that Joe did, I think they would just do because like they they have a big enough following where I think they would actually just be like, okay, hey, we're we have our own website now, just click this fucking thing and you can watch them all on here. Yeah, which I think that's how most people are gonna do it. I guess, but you lose a you lose a big chunk of your audience. You lose a big chunk because like obviously the main the main things are oh here let yeah me thanks you <laughs> thank you so much the, uh, but the main things are. Are like you know what I mean? Like you, like you're right with YouTube yeah, the, stuff the, like that. The big platforms, right? Like YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Facebook still somehow. Yeah, right. Like that's kind of weird. Cause you do you even use Facebook? No. Yeah, I, I haven't since I, I was like 15. Yeah, I don't even use Facebook. I uh, do you it was my Facebook? girlfriend. No. She was like browsing Facebook. I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? Are you fucking 50? What are you doing? Get off of there. Do you have Facebook? <laughs> no. No. See, I don't even yeah. have Facebook. I don't even have a Facebook. I had to delete everything I ever posted off Facebook because uh, a guy roasted me <laughs> in uh, in a cloud lobby. <laughs> <laughs> he found your Facebook? He was reading things I posted when I was 13. I'm like, fuck you, man. Yeah, but you were like, I shouldn't have had a phone. And I been shouldn't able have. To, and yeah. shouldn't have been able to post at 13. Yeah. You mad? Like... Oh shit! The shit that you did that's where you're fucked where like shit like from 2012 is gonna come you, like, you know fuck. what it was I remember I'll read it from my memory yeah hey Skyrim fans <laughs> <laughs> did you know if you boost your dad in real life you'd kill the universe <laughs> fun fact and he said that and I was like god damn it 13 year old me what were you thinking you probably scared all the hoes <laughs> <laughs> You yeah, you know, you think of the shit that you did when you were younger, and you're yeah. like, motherfucker. motherfucker, bro. Bro, I remember when I, I was, wonder no one talked to you. Yeah, <laughs> I remember like, do you ever like see the stuff that you did for like, like it's like cringe ass shit. Like I remember one this time whole podcast. Yeah, yeah, sure. And then <laughs> ten I, years from now, I mean, ten years of fuck. I why did I bring up furry orgy so, so often? often. <laughs> <laughs> bro, I remember I was uh like I was about like fifteen years old or something, and I was re- like really into this chick at the time. And this, and I only had my bike, right? Say I put full legal name. Yeah, on here. Yes, I remember that bitch. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so I was I was into this chick, right? Mm-hmm. And you know, uh, she she lived on the other side of town. Like, I mean, it was a 55 yeah. minute, like to an hour, like just pro- probably about an hour bike ride, mm-hmm. like alone. Like I was just pedaling, pedaling hard. <laughs> and th- for me, just like literally all we did, I, I'm not even kind of joking, was sat on the front porch and smoked cigarettes. That was it. That was the only thing oh, we did. Hard. And I was like, that's love. And it was like for an, like an hour and a half. And that was it. And we, I left like that. <laughs> like that was the end of it. And I was like, best day you ever had. That man. was awesome. That was, and now I get, to, now I get to bike home after all this. <sighs> <laughs> that's so cool just like that thing i sh- like before this is like fall in love with a girl never tell her marry someone else and be miserable be a man be a man <laughs> <laughs> i think of that shit and i was like he's so cool he's so right he's so right because it's like it's the same thing as the mall thing where you would go go to, to the mall and just walk around go to the mall and hang out with and then you'd be like this person may be there and you were like oh 
and talk for like literally five minutes and be like, okay, well, goodbye, guys. Like, and really, she was into me. <laughs> she was fucking she, down. She, she was you, down, bro. Did you guys see that did in front of Forever it? 21? Did you fucking see that? Did you see that? <laughs> you see that shit? You see when we were looking through the aisles and not buying anything? See the way she felt that she was feeling me? You see that me and her when we were looking at that sweater together? Did you see that? She touched my arm. She said that would look good on me. She touched my arm. Anyways, Dad, come pick me up. <laughs> that was last week. That was yeah. <laughs> that was <laughs> I'm still going to the mall oh, now, shit. just hanging out, just fucking chilling. Oh my god, I remember we did me and my me and the bros did that for like a <laughs> month. my bros did that for a month, and I'm like, I, I can't keep doing this. None of us have money. <laughs> we're never buying anything. Dude, no one had money. No, I'm like, we're mm-hmm. just sitting in these chairs. That was like back in when like Taco Bell was affordable when like tacos were like a dollar and everyone your boys were just like let's go get fucking tacos let's go get tacos dude the old food court the old food court I was right they actually switched it I don't know if you've seen it since but it's fucking they did a good job they have more options now but wow. like I'm also like one of those guys where every time do you ever because I hate going I'll I go to the mall if I like I mean if I absolutely have to like i mean like, only place that store is and it's in stock you yeah, have to go i have to go like it's something i can't get on amazon mm-hmm. like it's like okay i gotta i gotta go to this place to actually physically get it and every time i go to the mall i'm upset almost every time like yeah. there's never been one time where i walked out of there where that went smooth as fuck like you know what i mean never once have i walked in there and been like that went well today i'm glad i'm, I'm glad fucking, we went. i'm glad we went like you know what I mean? never once never fucking once i get upset I just get upset. Wait, my, I'm not that bad, dude. I don't. Get bro, people will just be walking, and they're like, you know what would be good if we stopped Stop. now? Stop it's right like here. it's like you know what? It's like a brake check. It's like a brake check and fucking just in the middle. Like they'll just stop right then and there. I'm like, oh okay. Like this is where we're stopping oh, okay. now. This is good. <laughs> this is like this is where I want to be right now. I liked going to the mall as like a third month of Dayton. Go to the go to a chapters to get books. <laughs> Yeah. Get Starbucks. <laughs> but this is it. I get both the things I like. A very expensive drink that tastes like fruit. <laughs> More books I'll never read. Let's fucking go. We really do like this uh Starbucks. I do, yeah. Well it's just <sighs> I'd never been. I had never been. An attractive blonde lady asked me to go and I haven't been able to stop since. <laughs> what was like do you remember the first thing that you drank berry berry like, hibiscus made with lemonade and then they got rid of it no, that was very my, berry I, I think i don't actually know what it was called i just would make that sound <laughs> into the mic and hope they knew very it. berry <laughs> very, uh, triple berry uh, t- <laughs> hibiscus i think but i knew but with lemonade they're like you know you know what you want and i bro like i said i remember one time because pat convinced me it was pat out of all people <laughs> It was fucking Pat <laughs> that convinced me to go. Because it was funny because I was, uh, before Pat like even had a car or a license, I would, uh, he would always hit me up. He'd be like, let's go. Yo, I, uh, I'm getting stuck because he has a, he has a backyard gym. Mm. And he's like, hey man, I, uh, I found this thing. It's all the way. Like he never, the cool thing was, is he never told you where it was at until he got in the car. So he went like, We got across town. He's like, so yeah, it's just over here, man. He goes, what are you talking about? It's only like a 45-minute drive. And I'm like, okay, like let's just go get it because I like you and I'm your friend. And, and you're already in the truck. And you're already in the truck and I picked you up. Like, let's go get it. And I go get it. And then one day he goes, uh, the guy's not home yet. He said, so you want to go wait out? Like there was a Starbucks near the house. He's like, do you want to go start? I'm like, I've never been to Starbucks. He's like, well, like, we'll just go in there. Just order something off the menu. And I'm like, okay. So I fucking go in there and I uh, like. <laughs> So I, I say, uh, like I ordered like my car. Co- I was just like, can I just get like a, like whatever a double double is. And he just said ice or chilled. And I'm like, I don't know. Or uh hot or chilled or whatever. And I was like, I don't know where to go. I don't know what you I don't think know I what. am. <laughs> I was like, I've never been asked this at Tim's. Like I've never once. That's too many options. It's already too many options. And then he asked me for like, what kind of milk you want? I'm like, oh dear. Like, I don't like. What do you mean? What kind of milk? What do you mean? What kind of milk? What do you <laughs> Chocolate? Got? Like, and he just listed off. Like he listed off milk I've never heard before. And oh, I was no. just like, like, I was like, oh my God. I didn't even know that you can get milk out of that. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like that's, oh, shit. that's insane. Every but, time I have, uh, I have the, the new drink memorized. No, you don't. I, d- I do sort of. Cause every time I get them, I got to repeat it. Got to repeat it a thousand times in my mind. 
before I say it. And every time I say it, they'll always ask for, do they, do you still want this in it? And every time it, it sounds different. I don't know if they're asking the same thing, yeah. but I panic. I always panic. They're like, do you want to keep this in? I'm like, yeah. Yes, please. I, I don't know. <laughs> I just feel like it's a lot of pressure. There's too many things. It's a lot of pressure as like a Starbucks employee, I feel. You think? I don't. They're always super chill. <laughs> they seem chill, but it's like, bro, I remember one time. So I, uh, I go to... Uh, I actually go to Tyler's house, believe it or not. Oh, yeah? And I, you know, I'm, I'm saying hi to people. I hug this one girl, and I'm like, oh, it's good to see you. I haven't seen you in a while. Knock her star, her fresh Starbucks out of oh. her hand. And I'm like, I know you took a loan out to get that. <laughs> people are doing that, and, bro. And I said, oh, that's so sad. And I said, uh, I said, listen, I'm so sorry. Can you just please uh, text me? Like, I'm going to go right now, and I feel terrible for Because I did. I actually felt like she didn't even get a sip out of it. Oh. That's how bad I felt. And she was like, it's fine. Like, stop. And I was like, no. Text and I like, text me the order. So I go and I walk in there and they're like, this inmate has never been here before. <laughs> and <laughs> and uh, so I, I just show them the phone. Like, I just show them the phone yeah. and I'm like this. And I, cause, but I remember when I seen the text, I'm like, there's like eight ingredients in this fucking coffee. <laughs> like there's eight, like I've never seen eight ingredients in a coffee. That's before. a lot. Like even I always thought it was a lot where they were like, do you want like a caramel shot? And I'm like, okay, like, who do you think I am? I was like, I'm good with just like, you know, cream and like the coffee or like sometimes I would just take it black just with sugar in it. Like that's it. That's how I would just take it. But it was like, this girl had this whole thing. I'm like, holy fuck. And then it was like, it came up to like $9. I was like, $9? Okay. Fucking goddamn. Oh my god. Can you imagine dude. you were drinking that every morning though? Think about how that adds up. Nine dollars uh, every day for coffee? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> no thank you. No thank you. It's a meal. That's <laughs> <laughs> I remember this one time. I go to Starbucks. I have three women in my car. I'm like, oh, I'll go in because oh, there's a lot of drinks here. And they all seem complicated. So they all texted me it. I went in there. Walked with the lady at the counter. I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing here. I don't belong. Here's what I need. And she typed it all out, made them. I go to pay. Card declines. Card declines. I was doing You've a lot of- You've told this story before. I right? have, because it was embarrassing. It's embarrassing, yeah. And I was like, oh my God, I can't go back out there and be like, I'm sorry, I didn't have $13. I did. <laughs> <laughs> She goes, sweetheart, just take up. I was like, thank you, thank you so much. <laughs> thank you for uh, not embarrassing me. Not embarrassing me with these women I just met. I'm so sorry. That would be tough, dude. Yeah. I, know. <laughs> I, like, I was looking back at the car. I was like, oh. It's like it's like in the like when they like people that shout out loud. They're like, hey, your card declined. Your um, card, it didn't go through. Your card didn't go through. And you're like, thank you for saying it to the four strangers behind me that know I'm in debt now. Thank you for thank that. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Like let's just like I think it should be just like commu- like no and just be like hey listen that didn't go through, <laughs> just like a little come over here <laughs> come over here for a sec. But then like people people would catch on to that they're like oh fuck he got called in <laughs> you know what I mean like, he, he got called back he got called back he didn't even pay ooh, <laughs> ooh shit hey eh? ooh yowzers yeah the, she did say it kind of loud she said it loud too <laughs> oh how many that people? didn't go through sweetheart I was like ah. <laughs> And she says, just take them. Yeah, well. Dude, that's clutch as fuck. Yeah. And I saw her like a week later. In the drive. I went through the drive. I was like, I owe you my life. <laughs> Bro, you did it for me one time. Tipped her. What? You did it for me one time when you worked at McDonald's. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Not that I, my card declined. You just gave me extra shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You were just like, what do you want? And I was like, I like fries. And you gave me like four of them. <laughs> like four large fries. And I was like, I'll never run out. Like this is, there. <laughs> and it was during like when the monopoly thing was happening there. Shit, eh? Yeah, nice. <laughs> it is. Nice. Oh shit! Uh, we're an hour. We should watch these videos. Let's watch some videos. We haven't said a single informative thing today. It's all right. Yeah, the fun one. The Prime Minister of Japan almost got assassinated the other day. <laughs> That's how you're gonna bring that up, eh? Well, I gotta bring it up somehow. I don't even know. I, I some of these are so old. I have no idea what they are. Oh yeah, this is. Oh, I've wild. seen this one. Yeah. Look at this motherfucker. Nothing bad actually happens here. Nothing bad. He's ba- just chilling. Thank God that steering wheel is locked in place. But it but it would take it would only take 
A small fuck up. Uh, a small fuck How up. How fast do you think he's going? He's going, he's going. He's going pretty quick. He's going pretty fucking quick. I mean, you hear that wind? Yeah. Look at how much his fucking jeans are waving. Wheel, wheel, wheel. I hope this guy's doing all right. I mean, he's probably dead, but I hope he's doing all right. <laughs> Boy had a dirt bike in the back. You know what he's about. Yeah. You know what he's about. He don't fuck around. That fuck around shit. <laughs> Would you do that? Yeah. You think you could do that with your car? Like with your, my car? No. Yeah. It's pretty low to the ground. It'd be like... <laughs> <laughs> like you know that Chrysler 300? The, the click? The click? Yeah. click. Yep. Mm. Skate videos. Mm. Broken leg. Yep. Oh, yeah. call that. Call that in the air. Shit, 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 shit. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck. Like three different directions. Oh, yeah. That's pretty bad. It seems like his hand was already injured, too. If you actually look what's on his hand, like it seems like he injured his hand. So, he... no, I mean, like, obviously differently, right? Look. Yeah, like he's got a. Yeah, it's like a splint, whatever the fuck that is. A brace. A brace, is that what it's called? Yeah. yeah. Fucking. Yeah, yeah. Wrist brace. I forgot the word for wrist. <laughs> I was going to say arm ankle. <laughs> <laughs> an arm ankle brace. My arm, my arm ankle. <laughs> Can we stretch na- your arm ankle? Name this, name this. That arm <laughs> ankle. Arm ankle is fucking so funny. Oh, <laughs> arm ankle, dude. I'm never gonna get over that. That's actually so funny. Well, I was like, what is this called? Oh, my fucking the ankle of the arm. <laughs> my neck hand. <laughs> Unfortunate for that guy. I don't even know what was. <laughs> this guy over here is like, I'll get that off him. <laughs> he got, fu- bro. I don't know how you're not KO'd. I th- I think it took hair off of him. Oh, look his at hair the size. Piece? Look at it. Look at the size of his head. Like boom. His hair. Look piece. when he comes up. Do you not see that? Yeah. Piece of his hair, fucking. Dude, I don't know how you're actually not knocked out from that. You should be like that. That hit him hard. You can stay down. That you can him. stay down for a while. Like he got, but the thing is, he got up right away. Like, yeah, that's what I mean. It's like he should stay down for a bit. That's fucking insane, dude. That's actually crazy. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. Thank God that car was there. <laughs> kind of right. Yeah. Like. Kind of fuck. Oh, that's a big crowd. That's never good. I think this is like a couple different angles too. Oh, dude, he got smacked in the mouth. Fuck. The scooter ones seem kind of wild, right? At least he's still trying. Do you think? I don't. I don't think that's him trying. I think that's his multiple different angles. No, because look, that he, that second one. That's that, a different that, attempt. That's an attempt. He does eat that to the chin, though. Dude, holy fuck. Doing tricks Dude, it his... looks like he hits his fucking mouth on that. That's hit. what I mean. He fucking takes it to the chin. Boom. Hits his, his chin off the ground. And then goes for it again. I mean, at least Listen he's wearing again. his helmet. Yeah, that's true. When we watch these videos, it seems like no, no one's ever wearing. <laughs> the scooter shit seems wild. Maybe I should try scoot. Like, no. Like, scoot. <laughs> Why? You think I'm going to be a at scooter that? kid? You think I can be. <laughs> sco- Don't be a scooter what kid. What about I pull up this dude on the scooter? Don't do that. What about <laughs> if I pull up this dude on the scooter and just went. Like, as our guest is in here, and I'm just like, you want to see my scooter tricks? <laughs> on a <the> table. <laughs> what is this? Uh-oh. I don't know. Not on the road. <laughs> I don't remember some of these. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, that one looked like it hurt. That one looked like it really hurt. Just head first. He didn't get enough. He jumped early. Oh, maybe he did jump early. Or he didn't go fast enough. Well, he jumps the first rail, it looks like. Just make it over the second one. It's just the, the back tire catches the second one. Mm-hmm. Unfortunate. Hope he tried to get it. Gotta lift the ass up. <laughs> gotta lift, lift the ass, ass up. And up and fucking let's go. Oh, I've seen this one. Yeah, this dude's KO'd. Bro. <laughs> 
I think it's called the Dead Rider Challenge, they call it or some shit. The Dead Rider Challenge? Yeah, let's see. I here. thought this dude was actually just KO. No, he's just pretending to be. Oh, he was pretending. Yeah. Oh, you see him get up at the last second. Yeah. He was just pretending. He was fucking around, but, yeah. the, uh, you know. Why did they, like, they waited until it was too late to yell and warn him? Well, they were watching him and then they go, whoa. <laughs> There's a shack there. They were focused on recording it. They were too focused on fucking. They're riding a bike and recording at the same time, trying to keep it in frame. <laughs> yeah, and they weren't worried about this guy's well being. Oh, this is wild. Bro. Think he meant to do that? I don't think he meant to roundhouse kick him like that. <laughs> Bro, I I think I, I thought he'd seen him come up, like, on the stage. Boom. I don't think he did. Because look at the way he reacted afterwards. <laughs> I don't know. Look, look he's, he does the, he does a pose looking at the crowd and then goes to do a kick. Bro, that he guy kicked him to be hard there. in the face, though. Like, like uh, that's Oh, not, dude, his hair <laughs> shifted. His hair shifted. <laughs> that's not a roundhouse. That's a spinning back heel kick, and it was executed perfectly. It was. like That's not the first time he's thrown that. You think he's done that to somebody? I mean, obviously, but like, other than this poor fan. Other than this, this time, probably not. Not that well. <laughs> yeah. oh, oh, big ass scooter ramp. How's a scooter trick drawing that crowd? <laughs> just slides. Down. Yeah, it just slides on his fucking face. It's like me when I fell off my dirt bike. <laughs> That's a nap with a lot of extra steps. Oh, just fucking slides down. Doesn't even try to recover. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm, I'm now down here forever. Disappointment is immense. <laughs> okay, this okay, this is kind of wild. Now, is that a hot dog and a samurai sword? Yeah. He's gonna hit him in the nose, isn't he? He's gonna cut this guy's nose nose off. Play it. Just play it, just play it real fast. Yeah, you got him. Oh, yeah, you got him in the nose. He got him right in the nose. You see his nose actually shift. Oh, that's off. Yeah, that's, that's off his off. face. Yeah. I called that. Bro, I called I that don't hard. Know. There's, but, like, <laughs> what I was saying about that video is, like, there's so many people in that room. And, and not, not one. one was like, don't do that. Not one was like. Hey man, I don't. We've been drinking, like you know what I mean. <laughs> I don't know if your aim with the samurai sword is that yeah. good. <laughs> and like this is kind of wild. So like it's just two women fighting, and the, like the kid gets involved. Hell yeah! Just watch it. Just watch it. That's kind of wild. Listen to the kid though. Listen to what he says. I want this bitch. You want this? He's, the, mom, punch her in the, the mom is telling the kid to punch her in the face. Nobody is stopping. I was going to say, I'm glad no one's stepping in. <laughs> Bro, watch it. He's punching her. The kid, the kid, yeah. The kid is now involved. Do some, do some. The kids, the, the kids stomping. Oh shit! And now he got the shampoo bottle. Now the one thing is, what that I kid to, had his mom's back. That that, <laughs> but that's also not that kid's mom's first time fighting in public with him. No. So that kid was like. Oh, yeah, get her. Get, get her. her. Hit her. Hit her, hit her, hit her in the face, Tommy. He would, hit her in the face. <laughs> this kid was like, you want me to help? Like, you want me to get Tap me in, Ma. Tap, Tap me in. in. This bitch could get it right fucking now. Do something. I'll fucking Do something. Tommy, drop the people's elbow on this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, he grabbed the, Off sh the shelf. He grabbed the shampoo bottle it and was like, like time to go I'm to work. This bitch. I'm hitting this bitch in the eye. Time to go to work. All right. What is uh, what you, you sent these? What is this? Art. Art. Okay. And commentary on humanity, but also just art. Okay, let's watch it.
Sounds about right. Yeah. Sounds about right. Work here is done. Brings you back to reality. It's like those, all those have, she has some like deep ass meaning. Yeah. You know? Like every <laughs> single one. It's like, especially the one where it's like, they're, you know, how we keep fucking it up, like just yeah. the planet in general, but especially the two beginning ones mm-hmm. was just like, yeah, especially when you think of like, what, why is like we the only, like species on this planet are the only ones that, Stru- like want better but like but it suffers so much you know what i mean well nature fucked up and created a being that was separate from itself mm-hmm. we're like just these animals with the illusion of self right so we're constantly just trying to improve that version of self yeah in reality you can't instead of just being what we were out there to be we're like let's do something else yeah what if we all can win and at the expense of everything else on the planet. At the expense for everything else. Yeah. Because it's fucking wild. That shit's wild. Mm-hmm. You know, you see all these animals living fucking life like. Just vibing. Just vibing. Dying. Dying. And like, I mean, they die in horrific ways, but. Mm-hmm. It's like, that's a, for a purpose. For a pur- feed something else. Yeah. But it's like, fucking goddamn. Like, all like I've never seen those before, actually. That was the first time I've ever seen that. Like the Any of those? Yeah, any oh. of those. Yeah. Never they're seen they're old. <laughs> Are they? They're pretty old, yeah. Do you know who the guy did it that did them or no? I think they're all different artists. Oh, they're all different artists. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's uh I think stuff like that, because there's a bunch of people I think I think that do stuff like that. Like I I haven't seen those specific ones, but I know like what that was talking about. Mm-hmm. It's interesting to see like how they just put it. Without even like not one word was said there. Nope. Like in any of those. That's nope. all like vision. Like and you uh, and we understood it. We understood it completely. Like yeah. understood it completely, dog. It's fucking crazy. Yeah, we suck. <laughs> we do. We suck hard. Not even in the fun way. Not in the fun way, yeah. <sighs> Fucking. All right, let's get out of here. We got to play Daisy with Zach today. All right. <laughs> Thanks for listening, y'all. Yep, 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 yep. This was fun. Yeah, it always is when we just fuck around for an hour. Yeah, it is. Uh, All right. Let's get the fuck out of here, buddy. Yeah, God bless. God bless. <laughs> Just, just, just received in our newspaper.